Hello and welcome back to our Ottoman campaign in the 1356 mod for EU4. Now we're in the middle of this lovely coalition war, but before I continue and press and pause, and we could crush, clearly we're going to crush the enemy, but before we crush the enemy, uh, just one little bit of uh, housekeeping. Uh, this thing here that we took, uh, Gothic cathedrals allowing the construction of various unique cathedrals, mosques, and temples across Europe and Asia, you have to basically be in the right place for for it. Um, so, for example, for me, um, as a Sunni, the closest ones would be in, I believe, Alexandria. There is a special mosque building that you can build in here. Uh, I don't believe these guys have got it yet. Uh, and I believe there's also one in Baghdad, uh, which again, these guys have not got yet. Um, so, yeah, that's it's unfortunate that we don't that we don't have these. Um, the, there's nothing in Constantinople for it. Um, but I'd look, and it really shouldn't be. Um, the closest one to being a unique mosque would be when you turn uh, the Hagia Sophia into a mosque. That I guess that could be one. Uh, another could be the Blue Mosque, uh, but that was built, I think, in the 1600s or something. So definitely uh, not really applicable. Uh, but anyway, with that all said and done and out of the way, I'm going to bring my Janissaries back to Kaili area. No, 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 they need to be staying here. Right, that's right. You're going to stay there. You're going to continue sieging over here. And we are going to continue. And hopefully at some point we'll be able to get our fleet to, you know, kill some of their navy. Um, at the moment they've got an awful, awful lot of ships, which is uh, worrying to say the least. But we'll see what we can do. Um, Caraman, I could totally make you a, an, a full state. It might be a good idea, actually. We're ten years ahead of time. We're not taking a uh, an ID group from admin. Yeah. Caraman uh, is definitely state-worthy. And can I sign a Pasha as well? Sure. Sounds like a plan. Anything in here? Still nothing here that can help me. I keep looking at it again and again, but I need to stop, because nothing has changed. Nothing. Uh, we are losing some money, but I'm not too terribly worried about it. Uh, lose some admin power, we just noticed that we were well ahead, so no problems there. Lost a few men here, still didn't manage to take the fucking siege. Come on, Nikopolje. 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 One of them, I don't know. Uh, but yeah, anyone can have military access if they want it. I'm fine with that. Um, that would be, what, 16,000? They've got a little ways to go before they get through k so maybe I'll wait for one more tick and I'll take this army and I'll hit them there. We've got a 424, they've got a 14, and they got a 24 as well. Oh, that's rough. That is rough indeed. We do have the White Horde on our side though. Sort of. Sort of. Not really, but sort of. Be nice if I could piece someone out. Did you call in any allies? Who have you got as an ally? Trebizond. You're in a coalition. Uh, and that's it. <laughs> there is no one I can piece out. Fuck. Alright, let's see how many men you get back. Come on. Give me some good men. I can wait one more month. I can wait one more month. Especially considering these guys are walking away. That's good for me. That is very good for me. But yeah, look. The amount of uh, ships they've got blockading me is really quite rude. But good news is I'm soon going to be able to abandon uh, Europe. Bring this army into uh, the east and we're going to be good. That is now good enough to hit this army, I think. Obviously, I want to be going back to Amasia afterwards. Uh, they're going to have a river crossing. Yeah, they're going to have a river crossing. And uh, negative one, I think, from the highlands. Uh, so it's not going to be too difficult, I don't think, to win this battle. And, ooh, Nicopolia has just fallen as well. Fucking beautiful. Right, get to Smiderevno. Smiverevno, don't know. Yeah. Nailed it. That's pronunciation right there. 
Ooh, if I had just waited that little bit longer, one extra day, I could have got another extra tick. Oh, well, my bad. Anyway, we're doing three times the kills to losses. That's good. They also have a trebuchet. They also have reinforcements, way more reinforcements than I was expecting. But I do not believe it's going to matter. I think we've still... Ooh, actually... That's a few more reinforcements than I was hoping for. Come on, if we can make them break before they... No, shit. They got here. We've killed so many. Just kill a few more for me. A few more. Just a, just a few more. Shit, now we're being flanked. Are we still killing more than we're losing? Yes. But you're going to arrive on the 1st of October and I'd rather have a monthly tick. So, go to Constantinople. We killed way more than we lost. Um, but, unfortunately, the odds were just a little bit too far out there. I can't lose that fourth, though. So, let's go. We have to We have to keep uh, Kaysidi. It's too important. He's far too important. Let's bring the 6-2. See if he can do some damage. They've got so many men, though. If they were all in from the very start of the battle, I might have won that. But the fact that they kept drip-feeding in reinforcements was really, I think, why they did so well. And now we have a Consort Regency, which is quite annoying, but we can handle it. I think maybe I'll get these guys to group up as well. Um... If I do that, it's especially with these guys, it's not the best tactic. But I think in this case it's probably fine. And then you're not gonna survive another hit. I'm fairly sure. Forty mil power for seventy ducats. Yeah, sure. And that'll also let me have a supply limit modifier. I do love this. Plus thirty-three percent. Also give me some innovativeness, which you know I love. Um, at the moment we're suffering 1% attrition for being over the supply limit. Uh, we, we may need to wait a second. Oh, we still are. Oh, that's a shame. Plus 118%. Yeah, we're, we're not that far over it. But we need to win this battle. Actually, one thing I probably could have done is uh, sortied while that battle was going on. Although that is risky as fuck. Please don't take it. Oh, thank fuck. Right, we got lucky there. And now Kayseri is saved. Oh, that was tight. That was very tight. And a stack wipe to boot. Can I catch you? No. Might get to aim tab though. No. Okay. Back to a mass yet. And we wait. Ooh. Luckily for me as well, the White Horde did not take land that I am wanting from Wallachia. So that's good. That's really good. Hey, White Horde, do you want to, you want to come in? Uh, if you weren't cruel, you'd totally come in. How old are you? 37? Fuck. Losing our great power status as well, which sucks. Really does suck. But I've got no idea where the Serbs are. I don't think we've found, seen their armies very much at all. There's 3,000 there, but really, I would have expected a lot more. A lot, lot more. And if you stand there, you are going to take some attrition. Uh, I can only have 21k here. So how about we take away all of the Janissaries. And two of the Cavalry. And, yeah, you guys... Actually, give me half the trebuchets as well. You guys can move back. You can go and do some sieging up here, I think. And this 15,000 glorious, glorious men shall stay here. That'll do quite nicely. Uh, da, 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 that's fine. Nice if, like, you were to join me. That would be real sweet, pretty please. Attitude towards enemies. Why do you like each other? 
We, we'd be in the money if we could just... I mean, maybe that's what we do. Maybe that is what we do. Maybe we take this army and we go and siege Theodora. Or we at least give it a, a good good attempt. The two siege leader. Let's just fucking go for it. Mamluks are busy with Georgia, who are going to get pieced out very, very soon. Um, yeah, let's go try siege Theodora. I think that will be a good idea. All my estate modifiers are over. Does that mean I can... No, it doesn't. Okay. It was worth a look. Uh, with that amount of admin points, I am going to stab up. And there goes Georgia. They have lost some money. Yeah, just money. Okay, that's fine. Thankfully, we are still allied with them. But now I will have the... the a chunky amount of uh, enemies coming at me. Um, this is going to be quite difficult. Uh, we're 19%. It's not enough. It's really not enough. But we did stack wipe their army, so that's good. Uh, let us take... I mean, I only need 3,000, right? Yes. Okay, good. So there's 1,000. Let's do it the other way around. Uh, take out anyone that's damaged. There. 4,000. The rest can go to Crimea. And hold. Actually, probably the rest can go to Kaffa. No. No one can go through Kaffa. Perfect. Alright, so how about you take that general? And just stick around. Do nothing. Now I'm kind of stuck in Amasia, which is annoying. If I try and hit this army, I will lose. I will lose that battle. So what do I hit instead? Could go to Koenig and kill this 1k stack. Which is turned into a 10k. But I then can be... No, I'd still be attacking into the woods. Uh, I'm in a pickle. I'm in a pickle. There's the Serbians, they've brought their entire force now. These guys just can't decide where they want to be. And catch a small number of them, and then do some damage, and then run away. I lost one ship, they gained it. Oh, lovely. Well. Okay, that's definitely not the best idea, then. There's some more Serbs. Yeah, this is the battle I want to fight. I want some reinforcements as well. What about you attacking that? Actually, it kind of... Hmm. Maybe we do this, right? Get everyone be able to join on me. We'll move to Axere. We'll get all of our vassals with me. We'll take them on in Kayseri. Right, you're booking off that way. So actually, you can just go straight for Kayseri then. You're probably going to turn around on it, but that's fine. Should be a stack wipe, I hope. And now gunpowder is a thing. Not a stack wipe. I really didn't want you to siege that. No, no, no. And now we're in the drylands. Not, not good. Not good. Not good at all. Uh, this is this is not gonna. Mm. Fook, solid fook. Ah, uh, we're gonna need to run away from this battle asap. This is not looking good for us. When can we run away? 11th of February? Oh, shitting ass. We're losing far too many men. It's the massive flanking that's doing so much pain. Oh, and the shock modifiers that they've got. Why can I not run away? I need to run. Rolling a 0 to a 7 is not helpful. Game. Run. Ouch. Very, very ouch. Okay, that was bad. That was incredibly bad. 
I still have the ticking war score. But for how fucking long? I need to be fighting here, not in Bazok. Bazok bad. Yeah, I'll take the pull power, why not? Alright, I guess we uh, just spend some manpower getting this reinforced and then we go and hopefully fight in Kayseri again. But man, that one sucked. That one really did hurt. Not much we can do about it though. Oh, no, I don't, I don't want speed 5. I see Theodora was over it. That's good. That's really, really good. Although, I don't know, how much is it going to really help us? Cosites Revolution, very cool. I uh, don't see him. Excuse me. You know what? I ain't gonna count. I ain't gonna. I ain't gonna question it. Just, just gonna say, all right then. Vassal's doing a relatively okay job of of keeping uh, Serbia busy. I mean, if they got their eleven thousand over here, then we'd be fucked. There's no way I could take on both sides, but I don't think I'll need to. I need to take this on. Although we could hit those Serbs. They are in the flatlands after all. And it seems like... Yeah, the Mamluks have gone up north to go for Theodoro again. So that actually works out fine for me. We hit these Serbs who don't have a general. I guess they're running away and the Chupanids are the ones that are going to stay there. Uh, we can purchase an ability as well. Which one would help us... Institution Embracement Cost and Spread. We yeah, do have the uh, gunpowder thing coming up after all. Look, if you're going to run away, I'm just going to hit in uh, Kayseri instead then. And I want to go to Amasia afterwards. This should be an easy win. Ooh, I do want to kill that trebuchet as well, actually. Lovely stack wipe. And do the same here in K Cilicia, very nice. Can I catch them in Caraman? Not quite. Alright, let's get up to Amasia so we can get that fort built. This 4000 should absolutely be able to kill two trebuchets without much pain whatsoever. Where are you going? You're going to Hamid, okay. Well, uh, yep, those are going to die very easily, and trebuchets are incredibly expensive, so that's going to be a good win for us, especially as we're going to be defending in the hills. They did no kills. Absolutely none. I'll take that as a glorious victory. Be lovely to hit that as well. We do have uh, a lot of dudes coming in from the other way around, which is interesting. Uh, more prestige is more manpower, so I'll take it. And again, I'll take the Janissaries out of this army. And half of those. And I guess one extra dude. You. Right. You guys go link up with this guy. Two 15k stacks is going to be the good ones. Oh, I want peace. We're so close to peace. We are ridiculously close to peace. You don't want people to join you. I do want people to join this army, my vassals. We'll see what we can do here. This Serbian army, I do want to... Oh god, the Mamluks are here. Fuck. The Mamluks are here, and they're over here. Good lord, what are we going to do? And here. Mamluks have so many men. Like, so many. We're two reasons away. We are two reasons away. We can go and hit some of their small stacks. Hell, if we can go... Yeah, that 4k, we're gonna hit it. Wait until you're locked. Oh, fuck. Yeah, you definitely want to go and hit this. This is... No, you don't. Fuck you, man. Hmm. Right. That's gonna be an easy fight to win if I can catch the bastards. A massive fort's going to be really good for us. Yes, caught you, bastard. Die. 
God, I fought this war so hard. Uh, yeah, blockade hurts, but what can we do? Not a stack wipe. Not peace either. One fucking reason away. Right. You get back over here. You're locked in, so we go defend the Siegers of Canic. That's going to be another battle in our favor. We should go up to 40. Ooh, 45 war score. <gasps> yes! Peace! Peace has been achieved! Yes! Oh, God. Oh. Oh, God. Can't make him a vassal. Can't get war reps. And go. How many ducats can I get? I can get five motherfucking ducats. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, man. What a war. What a fucking war. I mean, I'm going to take the five ducats. Because then that's like a few extra months of peace. God damn, what a fucking war. Killed 91,000, we lost only 40,000. Um, I'm pretty impressed with our uh, with our results there. Very, very impressed with our results. The Mamluks lost 27,000. Uh, Serbia, let's see, 19,000. Syria, none. Good lad, Syria. Uh, Valahia, none. Trebizond lost 4,000, the Knights lost 138 men, oh no! Um, where's the Chupanids actually? 11,000, so I, I lost the most out of all of the combatants, but I guess that makes Actually no, only 26,000, compared to the Mamluks, 27,000, so pretty comparable. Theodora lost 11,000, yeah, no, interesting battle, interesting war. Very glad it's over though, very... Very glad it's over. So I'm going to drop you. I'm going to drop you. And you, sir, are going to protect trade in Constantinople. And you, sir, are going to hunt pirates in Constantinople. We can enact a government reform, which is going to be court protocols. We get some representatives. Um, we get 15% manpower and force limit in non-colonial subject states and a diplo rep. Uh, we can get... Legitimacy per ally and some diplo reputation. We can get liberty desire in subjects and vassal tax while no subject has over 25 liberty desire. I like that. I like that. That's pretty decent. And then plus one splendor if you have over 50 prestige and you get more prestige. Uh, quite like that as well. Honestly, that's pretty damn good. Kissing the ring is. Mm, also very interesting. We wouldn't we wouldn't actually get any benefit from it whatsoever. But it's still interesting. Um I think I'm gonna go with the last one, theatrical performance. The extravagant and elegant customs of our court are the envy of any artist within our reach, and no notable has ever visited our court without being charmed by its splendor. Bit of extra splendor gain, which is this shit right here. Which is, you know, pretty good. This should go up to plus six in a month's time. There it is. Not quite a month's time, but you know what I mean. Good shit. Good shit indeed. Right. Uh, is there anything else I can do here? That piety one, I could probably do. But anytime I get there, I'm like, ooh, free money. So, probably not. Uh, let's get this army to go and take care of those uh, pretenders. Uh, this army can go to Constantinople and drill. And there's honestly not much I can do right now. Uh, I guess I could attack Caraman, but I've got a truce. Anyone that I've got a truce... I've probably got truces with literally everyone right now. I don't think I have a truce map mode. Oh, I do. Which I don't find useful at all. I don't I don't think truce map mode is really worth anything. I guess a Dulcadir I don't have a truce with. And Cilicia. I guess I could attack them. Uh, I guess it's a pretty shit idea, though. And uh, I think I'd rather not, if you know what I mean. Uh, we'll we'll just we'll just not do some more outrage country improve relationness, and we're gonna sit back and we are going to chill, and we're going to get rid of some aggressive expansion, and then when the aggressive expansion has gone down sufficiently, then we're going to be happy. 
right now we're not happy. Not not until uh not until we chilled a little bit. So you can drill, you're gonna drill as well. Thankfully we took to no loans during that wall, which um is also pretty damn nice. And we'll see where uh, we got the Amasia Fort, we got the Casery Fort. I think that's good for now. Obviously, I will be wanting a bigger fort because otherwise you shitheads will not shut up about it. Um Jalariads, I will get another alliance with you, even though you are a backstabbing, traitorous bitch. Um, at the very least, while you will help me, there is um, quite a hefty... Uh, what's the word? Disincentive for people to be assholes to me. So, we'll go with that. Anyway, I want to thank you all very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, feel free to click the like button. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye for now.